some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves at a traffic stop somewhere in Wisconsin, where a softard once again thinks he knows and is above the law. So, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. That's just fine. I'm recording that. Do you have any ID with you with your name on it? Sir, I don't need to identify. You haven't even articulated a, a crime that I've committed, sir. You don't sir. have a registration plate. That's against the law. Sir, this vehicle right here is exempt from registration. Well, now I would like to address one of the bigger elephants in the room, and that's the fact that you have no registration plates whatsoever. And according to Wisconsin law, you are obliged to have them. Which that pretty much goes for any state in the Union, considering, you know, the Tenth Amendment, which gets the states the rights to create laws that are not covered in the Constitution. So now let's address this other thing about your exemptions. Let's take a look at that, shall we? Well, you don't appear to be in the armed service, and you don't appear to be operating farm equipment, uh, construction equipment. Uh, are you a non-resident from another state? Well, you're still obligated to carry a driver's license from that state. Nope, I don't see anything here that would exempt you from even having a driver's license. So why don't you stop drinking the soft tarred Kool-Aid, eating the paint chips, and get back to reality? This is private. I'll, I'll show you the exemption, okay? okay. Can hands, I do that? Put your hands up on the dash for me. Can I show you the exemption? No, put your hands up on the dash for me. Don't leave them there, okay? Keep your hands up on the dash. I'm not doing anything, sir. Keep your hands up on the dash. I just want to roll my window up. No, you're not. Step out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle. Do not roll the window up. Oh, you don't have the right to, to hold my window, sir. Get you're out of the vehicle! Recorded. I'm not getting I'm out of nothing! You Stop! You're not Get getting out of the vehicle! Me. Sir, have I committed a crime? I'm you have not you. articulated a crime! Uh, yes, he has. He has articulated that you are not currently carrying plates on your vehicle, which in the state of Wisconsin is a violation, which is essentially a crime. So... What other pathetic soft-tard arguments can you articulate in the next few minutes? I want you to keep your hands up on the dash. What's your reasonable, your articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime, sir? Open your door. You're turning us into something it doesn't need to be. You're, I'm not Open even doing door. anything. You're, You're your escalating. Up. I asked you to keep your hands up on your steering wheel and you refuse to do so. Roll your window My down. My hands are here. Roll your window down. No, sir, you're, you're, you're giving me orders for what? How are you giving me orders? You're a public servant. You work for me. That's not how it works. That's not how any of this works. Yes, dude, he does work in a public capacity, but when it comes to traffic stops and other legal issues such as this, he does have the authority to uh, give you lawful orders during these stops. If you would stop consuming the copious amounts of lead paint chips that your sovereign citizen brethren gave you, then you would realize that you are not above the law, and neither are they. Exactly. It's for my safety. It's for my safety, too. I don't trust you. You have. You was just about to pull a for nothing. Correct, I haven't committed a crime. There's no me. victim. There's nothing. Ah, uh, yes, the no victim, no crime fallacy. Well, dude, there does not have to be a victim to be a crime, considering that even traffic violations are considered to be crimes, albeit very minor ones, which are punishable by fines. Step out of the vehicle. For what? Because I'm asking you to. I don't want to. That doesn't matter. You don't have a choice. Yes, I do. I haven't committed a crime. Ca can you vehicle. call your supervisor, please, I sir? To. I want to speak to your... <laughs> no, I asked for your supervisor. Call your supervisor now. And I would like my lawyer. That's just fine. Keep your hands up on the door for me. I'm telling you. Can I show you my paperwork, sir? Not right now. What the? F what? You pulled me over. I just want to show you the paperwork. Not right now. The, you at? You said this vehicle. First, you said tent. Then you said 
it doesn't have plates. So I'm telling you, it's it's exempt from registration. Okay, I'm gonna get your VIN, but when it's well, go ahead. No, because when I first did so, you put your hand down. And no, I was trying to let, let my window up. How am I supposed to know that? I can't see That's hands. it. I apologize. You're okay. not, you sir. I'm not. I'm a, yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's why it escalated. I, I apologize, I sir. So, I, I'm apologizing to you, sir. Okay. I did not want to make you feel uncomfortable or apology. unsafe. Okay. Just look at it from my point of view. Okay. Uh, just, I can't I see when you, you go below yes, the door frame. Yes, sir. I okay? understand. When I'm going in front of you, I understand. Yes, sir. Okay. I understand. I don't sir. want to make this any worse for you or for me. I want to do what I got to do, get you on your way. That's okay. all I want to do. Okay? Uh, I've never arrested somebody for not having a registration plate. Right. I don't want to start now. Okay. So do you have And you seem you like a, not a reasonable guy, sir. And I, and I am too, and I just want you to know to you're not in harm. I'm, I'm, I'm no danger. I don't and, have no again, ill intent. I don't even know your name. How, am I, how do I supposed to know you're not in a danger to My you? name is Aiden. That's okay. that's I'm what they I'm call me by okay. Aiden. So how about we just start this all over? Yes, sir. Okay, we'll start fresh. All right, do you have anything with your name on it that I can identify you? Sir, I don't need to identify myself if I haven't committed a crime, sir. But, okay, but you, you have committed a traffic violation. That's not a crime, sir. Yes, yes they are, dude. And if you stop listening to the Looney Tunes in your circle of friends and do some actual research, maybe you'd be able to figure that out. Or you it's have to have a reasonable, a articulable violation. suspicion that I've committed a crime. In, in order for me to, this is not a stop in, in, in identified state. state. Identify this is not a stop in identified state, sir. Okay. Can I, can I just show you the paper? Not right now. I don't understand. I mean, we're two gentlemen. I'm, I just want to show you the well, paperwork. Your window's half rolled down. I can't see in your back seat. I'll let the window down. I'll let the window down. And my paperwork, my book, see, I have one here. But okay. my other one is right behind the seat. I, okay. I don't have any weapons, sir. Just don't stop reaching. I just want to get the, the book. I understand that. And once it's safe to do so, you can, but not right now, okay? Y'all, you, you, you're going to try to escalate this for no reason, sir. And I'm just trying to show you that the vehicle, you can get the VIN number. It's, it's exempt from registration. It's a private automobile. I'm traveling. I'm not operating in commerce for hire. I got the notice on the back of the vehicle. I have my private privacy sticker. Ah, uh, it's great that you have all that worthless, soft, tarred garbage in there. I mean, that's all it's good for is garbage anyway. You might as well throw it away because it's quite worthless in the real world. So why don't you actually do something with your life and research the actual laws instead of these fantasies that you've been buying off these snake oil salesmen? I have my constitution. I have a no trespassing sign. This is private. And I'm a private individual. I'm not a U.S. citizen. Okay, that's great. Uh, question, did you renounce your U.S. citizenship officially? So that way you can select another country that you wish to immigrate to? So that way we can send you over there and you can uh, violate their traffic laws? Because I'm sure your new adoptive country would be glad to show you what they do to their traffic violators. Oh my goodness, man. This is ridiculous. So, to the gap, sorry, is it south one or north one you have? I'm just letting the window back up. That's my farm, so it's fine. I'm just putting a cigarette out, sir. All I would like to do is show you the the paperwork you can get the video. well i'm sorry folks but the video ends right there and he has not posted any follow-up information on his channel regarding this particular traffic stop but i am willing to bet that since the video ended so early that he ended up having to show his id or he got arrested or something of that nature it was something he did not want to show at any rate i hope you enjoyed the video Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.